Hey everyone. Is this is it be on or is it just me now? Yep, you're on. So I'm on. You're on. All right. Hey everyone. Uh, it's the Prime Minister. It's great to be here. I'm really glad that uh, one of my very first actions uh, as Prime Minister is to uh, reach out to uh, great schools right across the country. C'est un grand plaisir pour moi de commencer. Uh, mes responsabilités en tant que premier ministre en, en parlant et en écoutant uh, les questions des jeunes. J'ai vraiment hâte de d'entendre ce que vous aviez comme question pour moi parce que vous savez que pendant cette campagne, je me suis ancré dans uh, l'écoute et de l'engagement uh, envers les citoyens. This campaign and, and hopefully this government will be all about how we draw people in, into politics, how we make sure that they actually start uh, engaging in positive and constructive ways with politics, but politics is never supposed to be just about uh, a speech politicians give that everyone else listens to, very much about a dialogue, a conversation, and that's why I'm looking forward uh, to hearing your questions today, uh, and uh, I look forward to getting around to it. So I think we're going to start with uh, Sarvik School in uh, Nunavut. Uh, really great to hear you guys and see you guys, and uh, uh, let's... Uh, Hey, hey, I can't yet hear them. Are you guys? You guys need to unmute. I think. There you are. Welcome to the service school. My name is Heather. What Hello. do you know about us and 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 Inuit culture? Uh, I I have uh, been very lucky in my life to have been many times. Uh, up to uh, uh, the beautiful north in Canada and I first started going as a kid uh, with my father who used to bring me up uh, so I could understand how extraordinary the land and the people who live up there are uh, and actually over the past little while I was able to come up north uh, to meet with people, community leaders and, and uh, to share in community feasts and bring my family as well because it's really important to be able to share uh, my love uh, for the north with all of you. Uh, the, and, and with my family. Uh, the fact is Canada uh, is a country that needs to do a better job of giving opportunities and support uh, to the people who live in the north, who've lived in the north for so long and that means uh, making sure that we're working uh, with uh, you and all communities across the north uh, to ensure a better future and more opportunities. I am uh, always happy to get up there and happy to start uh, my uh, term as, as Prime Minister with the first question from you. Thank you. You're very welcome. All right, and now uh, we're going to l'école Romeo Dallaire. Uh, Je suis très content de vous avoir, de voir là à Winnipeg. Allô tout le monde. <laughs> Alors, euh, Monsieur le Premier ministre, euh, je dois vous avertir qu'on ne vous voit pas, votre écran est noir, je ne sais pas si ça c'est par exprès. De toute ah, façon, non. je vous, je vous présente... Euh, euh, pardon? Euh, non, vous êtes censé me voir, mais euh, on va essayer de voir ce qu'on peut faire. D'accord, je vous présente Messager avec euh, la question. Euh, bonjour Monsieur le Premier ministre, je m'appelle Messager Montberry. Et voici la question de l'école Romeo Daller. Est-ce que le Canada va faire? Allô? Bonjour. Bonjour. Oui. Qu'est-ce que le Canada va faire pour que les immigrants puissent venir facilement au Canada sans faire des choses dangereuses? Et allez-vous réduire le coût pour devenir citoyen? Mais le Canada est un pays toujours euh, fort, euh, pas en dépit de nos différences, mais bien à cause de nos différences. Et une des grandes forces de ce pays, c'est qu'il y a des gens qui viennent de tous les coins de la planète pour bâtir une vie, un avenir ici, et contribuent pas seulement à leur avenir et leur avenir de, de leurs enfants, mais aussi à, à l'avenir de notre, de nos communautés, de notre pays. Euh, alors pour moi, euh, de s'assurer que on a un bon système d'immigration qui permet aux gens de venir ici pour contribuer, pour bâtir ce pays, pour partager leurs expériences et, 
et leur, leurs espoirs pour l'avenir demeurent essentiels. On voit aussi qu'il y a des barrières qui existent pour devenir euh, citoyen euh, en, et des, même des barrières financières. Alors, nous sommes en train de, de regarder les meilleures façons de s'assurer que les gens qui veulent devenir Canadiens, qui veulent contribuer à l'amélioration de ce pays, euh, vont continuer de pouvoir le faire. Euh, donc, euh, j'ai nommé aujourd'hui un très bon ministre de l'immigration, de la citoyenneté et des réfugiés euh, qui va euh, se pencher sur ces projets-là et s'assurer euh, que le Canada continue d'être le pays ouvert et euh, qui souhaite la bienvenue à des gens de partout dans le monde. Merci. Merci pour ta question. Uh, so now we're going over to uh, Lawrence Heights Middle School in Toronto. Uh, great to see you guys, Lawrence Heights. Good afternoon, Mr. Prime Minister. I'm Roya from Lawrence Heights Middle School, and I'm in grade eight soon. So my question was that in your election speeches, um, you said that you will lower taxes for the middle classes and increase taxes for the richer and the higher class, but will this help in ending poverty for the lower classes and people in the streets? Uh, that's a really good question. Thank you for uh, for being concerned about uh, about uh, Canadians who need a, a little extra help and, and uh, opportunities. Uh, one of the things at the heart of our platform is a more generous Canada child benefit that we're going to start sending to families uh, that will actually lift 315,000 kids out of poverty. Uh, we've committed to giving more money to the families who need it uh, with the cost of raising their kids uh, by not sending that money to the wealthiest families who quite frankly don't need uh, the extra help. Uh, we've also committed to investing in uh, social housing and in uh, shelters uh, to help people with a, with a, a housing first strategy uh, to combat homelessness. Uh, we know that in Canada, our country only succeeds when everyone has an opportunity to succeed. Uh, and that means making sure that as a country, uh, we're giving uh, help and support to the most vulnerable. That's one of the things that I am absolutely committed to doing. That's what we're going to be working on in the coming years. Thank you very much for your question. Uh, and now I'm happy to flip to uh, l'école uh, du Dôme, ici uh, dans la région d'Ottawa, à Gatineau. Plaisir de vous voir, les amis. Merci beaucoup pour vos, uh, vos questions, votre présence. Bonjour, Monsieur le Premier ministre. Je m'appelle Ludovic Michaud et voici ma question. Vous nous avez promis qu'en 2017, l'accès aux parcs nationaux serait gratuit. Sachant que l'argent est nécessaire pour les protéger, comment serait-il possible de réaliser cette promesse? Uh, C'est une très, très bonne question, Ludovic, et, et je, peux, je peux te rassurer que uh, l'argent uh, uh, que ça va coûter pour donner l'accès gratuit lors de notre 150e anniversaire en tant que pays ne sera pas de l'argent qu'on enlève uh, à Parcs Canada. Euh, je trouve que c'est un cadeau que le Canada en entier va donner à ses citoyens, euh, mais on a besoin, pas juste de ne pas enlever d'argent euh, de Parcs Canada, mais on a besoin d'investir dans nos parcs pour s'assurer que nous avons euh, toute les, les, la capacité d'amener de, euh, des gens de partout au pays à découvrir ce magnifique pays euh, et à appuyer euh, cet apprentissage pour être de meilleurs citoyens qui se penchent sur l'environnement et sur le monde que nous voulons avoir en étant euh, euh, en ayant la capacité de visiter dans nos parcs en 2017, mais nous allons aussi donner plus d'argent à Parcs Canada pour s'assurer euh, qu'ils puissent livrer euh, ce qu'ils doivent faire euh, et aussi pour donner les opportunités aux Canadiens. Merci pour ta question, Ludovic. De rien, merci. Et on passe euh, maintenant à Tim, à Member 2 uh, Elementary. Hi, I mean, Gwei. I'm Alexis Christmas from Member 2 Elementary School. And um, I want to congratulate you on your win. Well, thank you very much, Alexis. I appreciate that. And um, my question is what did you enjoy most about teaching, and how can you use these skills as Prime Minister? 
Oh, that's a great question. <laughs> what I enjoyed most about teaching was uh, spending every day uh, with uh, a broad range of great kids who always had tough questions for me and who challenged me. Uh, and a good teacher is not someone who stands up in the front of the class and gives out all the answers. A good teacher is someone who knows the challenges that their students are facing and helps them solve those challenges and get the answers. Uh, that's what a good teacher does and I think that's what a good politician does as well. It's not just about having answers, it's about making sure that we're giving the tools to citizens to be able to create answers and to succeed. Uh, another thing a teacher does well is uh, understand you know, complex issues and break them down in a way uh, that uh, individuals can actually understand and be empowered by. Uh, a good teacher is someone with as many questions as they have answers and is someone who listens as much as they speak. Uh, and that for me is what I'm going to try and do uh, and focus on doing as a Prime Minister. Thank you, Alan. <coughs> Thank you very much and uh, let me just tell everyone how incredibly happy I am to be able to be with you here today. Uh, ça me fait tellement plaisir de pouvoir partager avec vous, de pouvoir souligner à quel point, à quel, quel point c'est important qu'un premier ministre soit accessible, connecté à l'écoute des gens uh, et j'ai bien hâte aux prochaines conversations que je vais avoir avec vous et avec des Canadiens à travers le pays. Uh, for me, uh, the biggest challenge I'm going to be facing in this job uh, is not get wrapped up in this job and remain connected uh, with the Canadians who elected me to serve them right across the country. And that's exactly what I'm going to work on doing, making sure that I keep listening, keep hearing your questions, keep trying to answer them, and making sure that we're working together to build a better future uh, for this extraordinary country and all the next generations. So I thank you very much for being so patient. I know uh, it took longer uh, to get this started than, than we would have liked, uh, but I've got, uh, uh, I had a lot of people to say hi to over at Rideau Hall, and you might have seen some of that on TV. Uh, but it was a, a real pleasure to be able to kick off uh, my day and my first meeting in my office uh, with great conversations uh, with Sarvik, with Romeo Dallaire, with Lawrence Heights Middle School, with Ecole du Dôme, and with Member 2 Elementary. Thank you so much, uh, all of you, for being part of this today. I look forward to the next time we all get to chat anywhere across the country. Merci beaucoup tout le monde. Thank you very much. Thank you.